Okay, so I had a lot of people ask me how I have uh, my function buttons set on uh, my GFX since they're programmable. So let's go into that. We also uh, have uh, 10 function capabilities. Uh, right up here at top, right near uh, my shutter release, I have exposure compensation. Same as I have on my Nikon and my X-T2, invaluable, so I don't actually have to move my hand. And I'll never use the play button right back here on the LCD, is that I have the play button set to uh, the front button where my middle finger is on my uh, right hand for uh, playback and review. Secondly, we have the uh, function button above the Q button, right up here, a little tiny button. And uh, this gives us a display of a histogram, RGB and white histogram. Okay, let's go back into our function buttons again. Number four, I actually have it set for auto exposure and auto focus lock. Now, obviously this is personal, it's wherever you wanna set it. However, I'm gonna give you a couple recommendations here in a second. Number five, which is this button right here below the joystick, I actually have set for shutter. Electronic shutter, electronic front curtain, mechanical shutter, etc., etc. Number six is photometry. It shows as AE, but photometry basically means matrix metering, spot metering, center weight. Okay, function button number seven on my four button around my OK or menu button, I actually have set for autofocus type, meaning spot versus matrix versus group. Uh, well, actually, they call Fujifilm calls it uh, spot versus multi versus uh, area. I would only ever use a uh, spot and multi. Uh, function button number eight is the size. Okay, like right here, I can actually set via my uh, rear command dial the size of my spot. The other button over here, this is AF mode, single point, zone, and wide tracking, of course. Okay, let's go back again. Now we have two more capabilities. I absolutely do recommend that on one of the uh, four buttons around your menu OK button that you do assign that to the flash function. And this is actually incredibly important with this camera. Whatever button it is you choose, at least assign one of them to the flash function. That's really important. The most important thing in these uh, 10 external buttons that you should have set as opposed to having them set in your Q menu is the most readily and often used stuff. Obviously, you can go into Q menu and customize that, like I have here, like I have peaking set, which is important for me. They set white, red, or blue peaking, uh, film simulation, so on and so forth. Uh, but uh, the key thing is that your nine function buttons are set to the most commonly used things and place them wherever it is most comfortable uh, for your hand to go. Obviously, it's very personal, kind of like the underwear that you choose to wear. There's no wrong answer, but just make it logical. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you like this video. This video was made at request of many people. And if you have a GFX, uh, congrats, and uh, good talking to you. If you like this video, drop a buck or two. Tell me to jump off a cliff. Whatever makes you uh, happy. Thank you for watching. Bye.